Hey, what's up everybody? It's Bruce. Today I'm in France at the base of the Alpe d'Huez climb, which is, I think it's fair to say, the most famous climb in cycling. And uh, I'm getting ready to give it a shot myself. It's 14 something kilometers long, I think 1,100 meters of climbing. Uh, the fastest time on record I think is 37 and a half minutes if I remember correctly. So I should be able to beat that today, I hope. Um, I do have my heart rate monitor on and my Garmin Edge 1000 computer, so I'll be able to track that progress. But uh, anyway, enough chatting, let's get going. This is a very tough part of the course here. He really has a lot of power coming out of the back of the, uh, out of the bottom of his back there. That's where his strength comes from. It's not easy. Close to the top. It's starting to rain. But I'm not stopping. I don't care how much it rains. Going through the crowd here. So he races now towards the finish. There's another fit athlete trying to keep up with him, but he won't stay there for long. Well, Pantani's got some very fanatical supporters out there. Many people felt that he wouldn't be competitive in the Tour de France this year because he crashed out of the Tour of Italy. And they said, swings into the finishing straight now. Two years ago he was winning, then he was injured, and now he's winning again. Pantani! Wow. Wow, I made it. Here I am, the finish. Not only of the tourist part, but like the actual race. Here I am. I gotta say, that was a little bit harder than I thought it would be. And at the same time, I think I went slower than I thought I would. It's hard to describe. I'm just glad I'm finished though, don't really care. And the old uh, Gamma Crucis, the old mountain bike, road bike, did a very good job, no problems at all. That's not totally true. Actually, I did run into one problem. I couldn't get it into the granny gear at the very beginning. So I actually had to pull over, stop with my hand, put it down in the small gear. So I need to figure out what's going on with that. 